showed you, we're going to wire in and install a new bathroom exhaust fan with a light and a fan built into it. It is controlled by two switches. One switch is for the fan, one switch for the light. Here in the country I was born in, we use a 14 American wire gauge on 15 amps, 12 American wire gauge on 20 amps. Black is live, white is neutral, the bare of the green is the ground. And also red and blue are live colors. And I'll show you how to uh, wire this exhaust fan. However, you may find white live in a switch loop or a 220, 240 volt circuit that does not require a neutral. So I'll show you how to wire this uh, bathroom exhaust fan. Okay, on our fan unit, we have uh, two white wires, one neutral for the light, one neutral for the fan, the blue wire for the light, the black wire for the fan. So this black wire is going to be for the fan, this red wire is going to be for the blue wire for the light, and this white wire is our neutral for both. And we have a green ground wire here to uh, ground the unit. So first, we will take and ground our unit. We'll take our green screw, we'll put it through our ground wire here. We're going to pigtail our white wires together. You don't have to do that, but they're kind of short. So we're going to pigtail them together. So I'm going to strip a nice new piece of white wire to go. I'll take them. And I'll twist them together like this. I'll get my tail in here. Get my insulation even at the bottom here. Wrap it right in here. Look and make sure I've got all my insulation even at the bottom here. And I'll put my wire nut on. And I'll look in my wire nut, make sure all my insulation is going up into the bottom of the wire nut. All the insulation is up in the bottom of the wire nut, so I'm just going to give it one more turn. So now we can hook our white to the neutral, get our insulation even at the bottom here like that. I'll wrap our strands around. Well, I'm going to shorten this copper up a little bit. It's a little bit long for this orange wire nut. I'm even, insulation even. Wrap our strands around a solid wire like that. We'll use our orange wire nut. And how come that didn't tighten? You know what? We'll have to just strip a little more and go back to ground zero and start over. Okay, 
see, so I'll just strip a little more off this white wire here. Okay, I'll bring it up here again, get the insulation even. There we go. And when I pick the fan up, I make sure I don't put any tension on the uh, wire. Well, you know what? This wire nut is garbage. There's no spring in it. It is garbage. So I am glad I have extra wire nuts with me. Again, we'll get our insulation even at the top, wrap our strands around the solid wire, put our wire nut on. Okay, there it is, it tightened up nice and snug. Okay, now we'll put our uh, blue on the red. We'll wrap our strands around the solid wire. Use another orange wire knot. When I pick it up, I make sure I don't let it pull on the wire so it doesn't come out of the wire nut. Okay, nice and tight. And we'll do our black one for the fan to the black one here. So we get our insulation even at the bottom here. We'll wrap our strands around the solid wire like that. Put our cap on. All together. Okay, so we'll just go over our wire nuts one more time, make sure everything's all tight. One, two, three. Okay, now we have this little hook in here, so we're going to put these wires inside our little box here. And put them inside the fan. Right. Now I'm just going to look here and make sure no wires are pinched on this side. No wires pinched. I look over here, make sure no wires are pinched. So now we put this up into our hole and we'll hook our exhaust fan, exhaust hose to the fan itself. Here. No, 
now we put our screws in to hold it in the ceiling. screw Move this into our board up here. There it is. The best I can get it. outlets up here the black one you plug your fan into the white one you plug the light into on here. So our light just goes in, uh, into it like this. I just gotta find the knot. put this back on the other hole so maybe we can cover this hole over here a little bit. be nice if I can, but if I can't, I can't. We're not going to frustrate because you don't frustrate over what you can't do. You worry about what you can do. I 
doesn't, it doesn't. So you don't frustrate. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Don't worry about what you can't do, but I was lucky. It, it moved to the other hole, so I can get both sides of this thing covered up. So there we got our cover in. Got our hole all plugged up. Put our bulb in. And our cover just goes in, you just push these little tabbies in, and you just snap it in like that. And light. Alrighty, so that is how to install a bathroom exhaust fan with a light here in the country I was born in that is required in a bathroom if it does not have a window. Peace. Thanks for watching.